Hello, everybody. So breaking right now election results for the second Georgia election, <laughs> the recount that uh, that President Trump asked for just happened. Have my little notes here, sources in the description box below. Day 15 of these daily videos. Not surprisingly, Biden still won. He still won. Now, the Secretary of State, Brad Raffensperger, he of Georgia, he ordered a recount by hand. So he literally had people count every single vote by hand. Biden still won. He still won. This is the very first time a Democratic presidential candidate won Georgia since 1992. Now, what Trump is trying to do is he's trying to have somebody go in and check the signatures of every single solitary vote. Mind you, there's thousands of votes and he wants somebody to cross-check the signatures of every vote. Do you hear that? I feel like there's always weird stuff going on whenever I'm trying to film. So that's his new bid. Now he's also still trying to do a recount in Pennsylvania, Michigan. Keep in mind, if there, the room for error is about 0.5%. Pennsylvania's over 0.5%. It's 1%. There's no room for error. You can't reverse four states. Jesus. It's like, ah, you lost. You lost. Voter fraud. <laughs> Look, does voter fraud affect some people? Yeah, 0.02%. That's the same amount of people that also die, well, the same rates as uh, COVID deaths. So is that a big deal or not? Is that rate high or is it not? You're outside of the room for air in Pennsylvania. Just give up, dude. You're, you're, you lost. You lost. You lost. God. <laughs> uh, so what I have in my notes is that in order for Trump to now reverse the election decision in Georgia, he's going to need three state legislatures refuting the count, supplemented with those actions being upheld by Congress, and then he might even have to take it to the Supreme Court. He lost. He lost. I'm, I'm like literally like Biden just came out and he just has a new cabinet pick, just created a video on this. His new pick is a guy, a Democratic candidate, who had accepted some of the most money out of any Democratic candidate from fossil fuel industries. I'm not happy about that dude becoming president. He's literally gonna support the same laws. He's gonna spit in the face of the left just as much. But Trump, you lost. You lost. Jesus. <sighs> Let's just hope when Tucker Carlson runs in the future, he'll learn a few lessons about how to lose, just like Trump. That is all. Well, actually, I should say if he loses. Jesus, I don't even know if Tucker Carlson would even lose. Well, that's terrifying. <laughs>